much do you believe in Ouija boards? Not at all? Or just enough to stay as far away from them as possible? Regardless of your views, you can't help but notice that there is some serious stigma attached to the Ouija board. Now what if I told you that a certain spirit was trying to do more than just communicate through the board? What if she was attempting to author books and poetry as well? Would you believe it? It all happened in the early 1920s and I want to get to the bottom of it. Is this like the greatest paranormal hoax, you know, perpetuated on the paranormal community?